So a lot of great care was uh, taken when we were designing the industrial design of all of our products so that it fit together as a family, right? There's a cohesive design language that ties all of our products together in this generation. Uh, and we had to come up with something that would um, really encapsulate all those components uh, in a very efficient footprint, but still be compelling. So we wanted this to really fit in with the things that are, uh, you know, in your living room or your game room. You know, previously we were, uh, you know, a vertical icon. It really stood out. With this, we wanted to be uh, very quiet, very confident, but still very capable. So instead of having a standard chrome or a standard black, you know, we have our very specific Xbox-owned dark chrome. Uh, and even down to the micro detailing, we have a new key for the ABXY button. There's three injection molding processes that go into making this key. And it becomes a new, almost a new icon when you're looking at the controller itself. The controllers for me are, you know, just I love seeing the things that weren't done, the design bits mm -hmm. that weren't adopted. Are the, did you guys machine these or are these 3D printed? So these are 3D printed. Uh, we have this on site. So this is something that we can iterate on very quickly. What we did was really tried to streamline a lot of the things that were um, I wouldn't call them problems with the real controllers, but things that we can improve upon. All of this is integrated into one, you know, simple shape. Everything's clustered together, mm -hmm. so it's it's easier to reach. It's easier to get, um, you know, rapid fire from trigger to trigger. Uh, getting rid of this battery pack was a huge deal. Yeah. So now uh, different size shaped hands can get in there. It's much easier to hold. It's much more comfortable. After a couple hundred controller mock-ups and what hundred versions of the Kinect sensor, is there one that we can actually take a look at? Yeah, we've got one right over there. Here we are. I mean, these are, here are the babies. It's meant to tie in with things that are already, um, already seen in your, your entertainment systems in your home. So really, again, it's supposed to reinforce that this is more of an entertainment box. Uh, there's, there's element upon element upon element that took great, great care with all of our 3D prints and all of our development. Uh, we're really, really proud of this product. Scott, thanks so much for being here and for, for showing us the final product. My pleasure.